So I'm going to get a block of quartz. Eh, I don't have the materials memorized, but I'll get the ones that I do remember. Um, a resin torch, a piston. Let's get uh, not, not the cobblestone wall. Uh, stone stairs. Redstone. Redstone. Peter, uh, water bucket, dirt, um, and sugar cane. Wow, as soon as I make these videos, I always get extra tired. This is getting tiring, like I said. Okay, now hopper, chest, glass. And let's see, I think that's about it. Uh, yeah, that's it. Alright, so, start building it, and I'll show you. So, in Minecraft, a lot of people know this, but certain blocks, or certain growing things, can be zero ticked to make them grow extremely fast. So, first thing, you're going to want to make this. Or in other words, a normally quick redstone clock. Oh, the tutorials is a zero tick sugar cane farm escape. Man, you haven't watched my broadcast in a while, just saying. Oh god, yeah, no wonder that's slow. Ugh, that's a lot of ticks. There we go. The next step is to... And this thing add this and if you'd like to keep that quiet do that because that's that does get loud eventually make this specific shape yes I have friends in this world zero take sugar king farm need the glass um, I'm tired. I, I like every every stream or video I make. I always get even more tired progressively. I put the water in right now. It's not gonna flow because I've already blocked it. Never mind. Yet again, I've been mistaken. I'll do this for temporary. And then we're gonna want to put this piston here and get your redstone dust and put it like this. Currently that's going to be off. But as soon as we put that there, we put the redstone torch. Try to do it a little closer. Here. That will happen. And yes, that is actually supposed to happen. So, it's a quick tutorial. But it is effective. Now we're going to want to pop her over here. First thing. But the sugar cane here, and here we go. Now, as an add-on, seeing as I've only made this video four minutes long, I'm going to add in how you can make a on-off switch and A storage system for it because you will need probably both of them. Oops, there's that part. Now, the storage system is just the tiniest bit more complicated. And I don't know what this guy was doing, but it 
I don't know what that is. So this this is one of my friend's worlds. They're apparently trying to make a bunch of storage systems, but like sorting ones, but uh not any of them I've actually seen tutorials for it fully work in the way they say they do. So we have to make three pillars of glass. Two blocks two blocks tall preferably. So that you know where the actual solar system itself will be. Now, the next step is, well, you can clear out your thing because this time we're going to be needing these. And this is going to be the legitimate storage activating thing or whatever you want to call it basically it will sort it will not sort them but it will shoot them into the storage system itself don't build out of blocks of diamonds one because it doesn't look nice two because it was an accident and it, it's probably not possible but anyways back to the game now if you put any amount of any item in there it will get dropped out in a fashion like this. And yes, this is Bedrock Edition, in case you're wondering. Minecraft Xbox is exactly what I want. You know, let's just take those out. Ooh. This is laggy. No. Next, you're going to want to build a pillar up, however high you want your storage system to be. I'm going to make it about this high. I'll put the storage system about four layers. Let's see. Go all the way up here. Now the next step is soul sand. Legitimately, you're going to need it for the system itself. And, of course, a water bucket. I just got a beacon. That was an accident. Trust me, I'm not going to put a beacon in there. It's not going to float. That's the dude I'm making this tutorial for. Mind you, but I need you to get out on it, Oreo. I'm fairly certain... You have to put it in after you place in the water. Don't like that, but it's gonna be how it is for a few Minecraft for a few Minecraft updates. Now the next step you'll need blue ice or packed ice or whichever you wanna do. Something that actually multiplies item speed. When flowing down one of these. I'm going to direct this a little bit away from all this stuff because, well, that's a lot of stuff and there's not a lot of space. And then, uh, yeah, I'm going to quickly make this pipe here. And then I'll place some water in specific signs. Well, not specific, but signs that will stop the water. I had thought... For a while, that signs have been updated to where they can now be waterlogged automatically whenever water touches it, but apparently not. I would also suggest you do this because, uh, you know, I'll try the normal Minecraft way and I'll just do this. Let's see if that works. If not, then we'll you'll do what I'm doing. Dinner. Hmm. That's going to happen most of the time. I, oh yeah. I guess there is a reason to do that.
fairly certain water's bugged to away. But the best thing you can do. Oh wait, I'm gonna try some another strategy. Yeah. Yep, there we go. Alright, so next step is to add in some signs. Or these places. Water travels eight blocks before it runs out. So you'll add in signs after each one so that it doesn't run back into itself. Or a copy of its block type. Now this is a part where you do need more hoppers, sadly. I don't know if you're tired of placing hoppers, but... <sighs> I hate building with diamond blocks, but I will. Uh, that looks about wide enough. I... am certain enough as to where I have to... ...do this. That it's going to have to do that, or it might not work. I'm going to go over and block that off so it doesn't annoy me anymore, but yeah. Minecraft casualties as well as real life. Oh well. I'm a tough dude. There, chest, hopper, chest, hopper, chest, hopper, chest. Uh, yeah. So I'm gonna yeah, that was not an intended building thing. This, I believe I did that right, nope, apparently not, let me fix that. Yeah, this is getting, getting boring to watch to you, isn't it? Well, how about this? Do you like me to play music in my next videos? Um, I'm not sure if you'd like me to do that. I could, but you'll have to tell me. Because I don't know. More diamonds. They're diamonds. I don't, I'm not supposed to build with diamonds in any case. And most of you people out there watching this are just like, oh, but I build out of diamonds. I build my houses out of diamonds. Don't. No one likes it. It never looks good. It's not mean to shut you down, but even you've got to admit, it doesn't look very nice compared to what you can build. Alright, the final thing I'm going to show you with this video. Is the thing that will tell you if it's full or not, or if it's well the chest being used. You may not 
exactly tell you if it's full. Oh, also you can minimize this little size down to that much. Because it'll go through here and whichever one's full, or whichever one's not full, this will go into. That's hopper logic. I don't understand it very much, but it but it it's just how it is. Alright. Anyways, back to the tutorial. Make this little pattern. Actually, shoot. I recommend. No, I did not mean to say recommend, but I did. So there's nothing you can do about that. I recommend you do this first. Bottom first, then you go up. That's how that's going to work. So, we're going to want this. And this. And that's going to be most of this. Well, that is going to be basically this little circuit thing. But that was the wrong one. You don't want repeaters, trust me. I don't know what was in there, but it kind of glitched. Now, do the same thing going all the way up here. And skip to the next part, which is the redstone lamps. Because, guess what? I don't have time lapses, slash, skip, or cutscenes, or whatever you want to call it. Alright, final part. Now, redstone lamps. So if we start up the machine in a second, it should start working. Also, if you want to make it look nice, you can put green here on top of these lamps, yellow here on top of these, orange here on top of these, and red on top of these. Basically, it just tells you how bad, that is bad it is. Also, yeah, this works. Now, connect this all up. It should start working. Here. Let me go this way. See, that's where I'm wrong. That's why I suggested this. That's the technique I usually use. This is Bedrock Edition, not everything in Java works, trust me on that. Now, go over here. Oh, hmm. guess I wasn't expecting that. Uh, what if I make that solid? Oh, no, 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 nope, nope, nope. Frick. Okay, anyways. Eh, oh well, whatever, that's fine. But, there we go. You've got a working thing. That is the full tutorial. Thanks for watching, and yes, this will be YouTube in a bit.